아, 지금 기분이 어떠세요? 선수분들. 기분이, 기분이 어떠세요? 네, 지금 이제 굉장히 이제 이렇게 농구 얘기가 뛰어난 걸 너무나 이제 굉장히 기쁘고요. 네. 이제 화요일 날 시합이 굉장히 좀 기대가 되는 것 같아요. Okay, so he says that um, he's very happy first of all to see that there's so much passion for basketball in this country, and he's very excited for the game on Tuesday. Now, um, this question, um, I, I want to ask um, partly because I'm slightly partial to coach Jim and Emra, but how are they preparing? for the game. If you want to give out strategy, that's fine. But, you know, mostly their preparation um, coming here. Uh, yeah, so, uh, the how do you think about the game? How do you think 세계 선수권대회에서 지금 필리핀이 아주게 그걸 투표할 게임을 한번 봤습니다. 이제 그 박신감은 넘치는게 이걸 받고 좋은 경기력으로 보여줬던 것 같아요. 그래도 아쉬운 것을 같이 느끼면서 봤습니다. 이제 아쉽게 경기를 줬는데 우리 경기력은 좋았던 것 같아서 어, 그런 마음을 했고요. 어, 특히 그 우리가 화요일 날 게임에는 어, 히네브라라는 팀이 어, 필리핀에서는 굉장히 전통도 있고 또 많은 팬들을 확보하고 있는 걸로 알고 있습니다. 그래서 그런 전통이 있고 좋은 팀하고 경기를 한다는 것에 대해서 우선 어, 영광스럽게 생각을 하고 어, 우리도 사실 그 KBL리그 준비자들이 회장으로 오는 그 상황이기 때문에 어, 좋은 경기력을 우리도 보여주도록 할 것이고요. 더 좋은 그 경기를 하면서 우리한테 도움이 되고 또 이래버렸지 않아서 좋은 경기 경험될 수 있을 것 같고 팬 여러분들한테 좋은 경기를 보여드릴 수 있도록 하겠습니다. I'll try my best. Okay, let's have a try. First of all, he said, um, last night, I'm sure you were all watching, they were watching as well, the Philippine and Nila Steve go up against uh, Puerto Rico in the FIBA uh, World Cup, that's right, thank you very much. And he saw that the Philippine team performed very, very well. Of course, in the end, uh, the Philippine team ended up losing, but he was very, very impressed with the performance of the team. So, you know, with that uh, in his mind, um, he, uh, the team, the Korean team, the, the Sabres, are also in the process of preparing for the Korean basketball team. So, it's kind of like a, a trip that they made to not only play with you know, San Miguel, which is which he knows is the is an institution in the Philippine uh, basketball scene uh, that has many, many fans. He also thinks of this as added practice for the KBL as well. So he's very excited to be here. He's very honored to be uh, going up against the team like in San Miguel. So it's kind of like a win-win situation for the LG Sabres. And, you know, uh, I, I guess it's it's fitting that both teams are sort of in the same position as in also preparing for a brand new season in the PBA. Uh, my next question is, how do they plan to defend the pick and roll? No, I'm kidding. Um, to, I don't even understand that. What? <laughs> to, the, to the players, to yes. the players, uh, what are they expecting from the Filipino players? I don't know if maybe they've, you know, they've heard of Greg Slaughter, maybe they've heard of Mark Aguila. What are their expectations uh, against uh, the competition they'll face? Uh, <웃음> 예, 일단 어제 게임을 봤었는데 이제 굉장히 화려하고 또 굉장히 공격적인 공부를 하는 걸로 아주 개인적으로 생각을 했고요. 무슨 농구요? 어떤 적인 농구? 네, 이게 좀 공격적인 농구. 공격적인. 예, 공격적인 농구는 생각하는데 이제 거기에 대해서 제일 재미있어서 이제 발표를 잘 해봤죠. 네, 네. Um, actually, he says that um, he got most of his mental preparation and notes from watching the game last night, the Manila the game uh, in the FIBA World Cup. So he noticed that you know um, it's a very strong team, a very strong team, the, the, the offense. So that's kind of what he has in mind in preparation for this event, and that's what he's expecting from the Filipino players as well. Okay. Uh